Hi everybody, it's Jeff. This is going to be part 11 of the uh, Mini Art US Armored Tractor build in 135th scale. Um, before we get started, I just want to remind everybody that uh, tonight, uh, it'll be 2 p.m. my time here in Colorado, it'll be 9 p.m. in the UK. Uh, I'm going to be on live with uh, Jason at Model Kit Stuff and James for James at uh, Tobo Legal Model Works on Jason's channel, the Model Kit Stuff channel. So I'll put a uh, link in the description of this video if you want to come over and say hi. Uh, probably last an hour or so. And then also uh, with Christmas coming, I'm going to take a little bit of a break. Um, Today's the 23rd. Uh, we have a family member has a birthday tomorrow. Then we've got Christmas Eve, then Christmas Day, and then two days after Christmas we have another birthday. And uh, so I'm going to go ahead and probably be pretty busy. <laughs> I might work on a few things. Uh, if I do, I'll record things, but I probably won't put another video out for a week or so. <clears throat> I'm sure you guys all got a lot going on too. And uh, I want to spend some, you know, family time. So let's go ahead and go down the bench and I'll show you what I've got going on, okay? I'll be right back. Thanks. Okay, uh, in the last video, we finished these, which I won't assemble or won't attach to the actual dozer until we get some painting done. But uh, they're finished up and they're ready to go. Real happy with the way those turned out. I've got parts for the seat and then uh, beginnings of the winch. The winch is really involved on this. Uh, lots and lots of parts. So this will be just the very beginning of it. Let's go to the instructions and I'll kind of show you what's going on. Okay. Okay. Uh, we finished step 50. And then on 52... We've got the, it's the gas tank and the seat all together. Uh, I'm not going to put the cushions on the seat yet because I want to keep those separate for painting purposes. But we can go ahead and start assembly of the seat. And then uh, I, I haven't finished uh, cleaning all these little levers and stuff that come through the floor yet. So uh, We'll do that a little bit later on. But uh, then I've also got parts for the winch I've got cleaned up. Um, I'm not going to be able to assemble it completely. We've got some rope that I've got to figure out lengthwise and that type of thing. And then uh, I don't want to put the rope on until I do some painting. So I don't want to get the, get the paint on the rope. So anyway, let's go ahead and see what we can do about getting started on this uh, this seat here, okay? Okay, here's pieces for the to start the winch and here's some parts for the seat. Get rid of the glasses there. Okay, here's this here's the base for the seat right here. This is going to be kind of tricky because we've actually got kind of a part that kind of hangs up in midair. Um, this will be the base for the seat. These are going to go like this. See, this is going to have a, just kind of be hanging there. And then we've got this that will go on the back of it. Okay, so it's going to be interesting. See how it all comes together. Let's see, we'll put some glue on here. Yeah, we got a lot going on at Christmas time. Not so much New Year's. We're not big on the New Year's Eve kind of thing, but boy, Christmas with birthdays and everything else, it's a pretty busy time for us. Okay. 
that's going to be approximately like that. I'm thinking about doing this in a couple of different steps. This goes here. Let's see. Put that there. I'm just getting it straight in my head. Let's do this. That's going to be the top of the fuel tank, and there'll be a filler set right there. A little bit of a gap there. Yeah, it's not too bad probably got carried away with my sanding okay um, this will go like this and then there's going to be some this is going to be interesting some parts that are going to sit like this On the side. Interesting. Let's go ahead and put those on. It's not exactly following the order that the instructions have us. Assembling. Okay. I really appreciate all the comments you guys made about my soldering. It's been a long time since I've done much of that, but it was a lot of fun. It's a skill that's really handy with the photo edge. Okay, there's like that. And I think this is going to go like this. Not exactly the way the directions tell you to do it. looks pretty good wanna, let's see here grab some tweezers and push that up a little bit
Okay. Sorry, just concentrating on what I'm doing. Making sure I get all my joints nice and tight. Okay. It looks pretty good. Going around making sure. Might have to put a little clamp on that. It's just not quite closing up. Anyway, this should go on here, if I did it right, and it does. Okay, I'm going to put a little glue around here. get it started Okay, got a little bit of a gap there still, but I think that's my sanding. I might have to do a little filling. Okay, these parts here are, are armrests, and I think they go like this. I'm not sure if I should put them on until I get the seat cushion in there or not. They might be in the way. Look. Let's go ahead and put the filler in. Okay. And there's supposed to be a little drain plug right there. Unfortunately, uh, I can't find it. I think it might have pinged off when I was cutting it off. But, uh, I'm not sure you'd even notice that it's going to be completely hidden in the back. I can show you where this goes. Let's go ahead and just hang on to these for a sec. And hopefully this will fit where we're trying to put it. It is just a little bit snug. I have to do a little little adjusting okay that's where it goes this plate will go back here I'll have to do a little fine tuning to get all it, everything to fit right but yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay, let's go ahead and just set this aside. We'll let it dry and then uh, 
I'll mess with the winch for a little bit, okay? Hang on to those parts. Okay, let's go back to the instructions real quick. Okay. There's a lot of little things to do. Here's the part I was going to work on. First thing I have to do is assemble this, which is just actually three pieces. This uh, E521 is, that, it's really an interesting shape. Here it is right here. It's all molded. Yep, let me see it. Let's switch the camera back. Here we go. It's all molded as one. I just almost broke it there. Yeah, that's quite a quite an interesting job of molding. Okay, let's see what we can do about getting some of this put together. I did assemble this already. This was two pieces, just to where um, I could sand the seams and things. So making sure on this side. go like so those go in there okay so we've got glue here and here careful I don't break those handles okay and then we have this that goes over it. Set here. Okay, and then this this right here will attach to the back of the uh, back of the bulldozer. Yeah, this is this is a very complicated piece. There's going to be all kinds of pulleys and different things. I'm sorry, I don't mean to be off camera here. Okay. That's the parts that go on the back side. Then we've got these, which are the brakes. I think they're the brakes. It'll go here. <laughs> And they're going to go like this. They're going to sit in that hole just like that. Okay. Okay, and the other one, okay, 
and then this is the part where I'm starting to think let's see I'm just checking to make sure this is going to go here and this is going to go here they're supposed to be this um, go between them Just like this Okay. And then, whoop, and then there will be two spools that set in there that I really don't want to glue in yet until I get the ropes and everything lined up on them. So. I think I'll do it like this. There. There's actually a little keyed spot right there that that's supposed to set in. Try and make sure everything stays nice and straight. Okay, there's that. I'm sorry. Hard time keeping you guys on camera. And then we've got these, which are the spools. They're kind of tight. They, they'll fit. They're a little, little snug, but they will fit. I need to wrap the string or the cable or whatever you want to call it around those before this is all finally assembled. Okay. Just like that. And then we've got Trying to make sure I'm doing this the right way. There's some really tiny little pins. As long as I didn't sand them off. Right here. It'll, it'll go like that. Wow. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and glue those on. Okay. And this one.
supposed to be a little spaced up off the other part. Trying to get them straight. Okay, I think that's good. So these will set in here eventually. And this will all set in here. And then we've got all kinds of other things to add to. But I'm going to probably call it good for now, guys. Let this stuff dry good. And uh, like I say, I'm going to go ahead and take about a week or so. Uh, hang on a minute. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. That's going to do it for today. I just want to wish you guys all a great uh, holiday season. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year uh, to everybody, and uh, I'll be back shortly. I really appreciate your support and uh, watching the channel, and I'll be back soon, okay? You guys all have a great holiday, okay? Bye-bye.